Hello, everyone. This is my new Tibetan singing bowl playing the ukulele. If you look inside, you can see it's beautifully carved. I'm told hand carved uh, for that part of it. Looks like it was spun on a way. There's a bunch of writing on here that I don't actually recognize the uh, the script. And this looks like it has a bunch of numbers here. It looks like it says W3510 and 0110 to me. That's what I see, but it's probably actually a real symbol. I think it's actually supposed to be like the ohm symbol or something, I'm not sure. It's painted on the side. As you can see, it's got this lovely design. It's probably showing backwards on here because YouTube does that and my webcam does that. I apologize for that. But yeah, it sounds wonderful. Bell. Now, this is made out of the same kind of brass that they make drum cymbals out of, with the same type of composition, so the uh, same copper, tin, bronze, and silver that they put in your standard drum cymbal or gong, but this is much thicker than a drum cymbal or gong, and I believe, I hope it's more durable. I'm told that this carving on the inside is done by hand. I don't know how true that is, but because to me it looks very much like a machined thing, especially if I look on the back, I can see lathe marks. But then, lathes have existed for a very long time. I know this is not a new bowl when, when I bought it. I paid a lot of money for it. But, it's a uh, stupid screensaver. Why do you do that? Now it doesn't go back. Anyway, sorry about that. Um, yeah, so this bowl is beautifully carved. I don't know exactly when it was made. It could have been made last year and it could have been made a thousand years ago for all I know. Although like I said I can see that it's been lathed on this side. That may indicate uh, a positive uh, recent thing but it probably doesn't because it's a very old style tool mark. Like uh, more of an ancient type of lathe that it, this part was turned on. Uh, and it seems to just be on the bottom of the bowl, and then the bowl seems to have been crafted over it. Um, it's got a nice thick bottom. The whole thing is pretty thick. It's about uh, about a quarter inch thick, which is pretty thick for, for a bronze bowl, or a brass bowl, rather. And it sounds wonderful, as you can hear. So hopefully, apart from my screensaver cutting in in the middle of this, uh, things should be good. Okay, just thought I'd let you guys know.